A 2 0 victory this afternoon, yeah. Craig Harrison. Were you happy with what you saw? Yeah, look, it, it's a cup game, isn't it? It's a semi final. You know, we, <laughs> the whole top button is want to get to the final. I don't think it was our best performance, but but we we done more than enough to win the game, and we have probably done more than enough to score more goals as well. If you look at the second half, obviously getting that second goal is key to us. You know, a really good timing, and it just changes the complexity of the game completely. Pennebon have got to really come out the second half, which stretches the game, which give us the opportunities to get. I think Danny Williams went in one on one twice. Ryan Brobble, they've had two clear off the line. Etc. Etc. And I think you know Connor Roberts had one save in the first half. You know we've defended brilliantly, set place because because I think you've got to you know the, the back four. Everyone in general has done really well because they're you know they've got some really strong aggressive headers of the ball and they put the ball in dangerous areas with Kane on fantastic left foot. You know so now um, we, we defended well. You know we really did. And with 15 minutes on the clock, we did it, the woodwork. Were you happy yeah. with the way that the game was progressing at that stage? I, I don't want to be too harsh on, on the players whatsoever. I don't be too harsh on the, the occasion because the occasion is you get through the cup final. Yes, could we improve? Yes, 100%. But, but me being me, I think we can always improve. We, we could improve when we went in 1 7 0 at Cardiff Met. We could improve when we scored 10 against Flint or 9, whatever it was. So. The important thing is the occasion that we got through the cup final. You know, it's something that um, everyone loves a cup final. If you don't, something wrong with you. So you know that that alone is is nice to to come back this year and, and get to the Welsh Cup final again. And it uh, it could make it interesting against Bala, considering that was my last game of my first reign. And it was a, a great opening goal as well. Lovely pass yeah. from Leo Smith and Josh Daniels slotted that one away calmly. Yeah, he did. You know, you know Josh has done a great job at right back for because you know early on in the season we didn't have we had four or five players out and he played in there. He's not a natural right back. He's a winger by trades. You know, and he's done a great job. And, and you know, the way we play with attacking football, he's he's done great in there and, he, and he's been fantastic. But obviously, needs must today. We played him high up the pitch and you know spoke to him midweek about being more direct, being more aggressive being more front foot and positive about scoring and crosses and you know because they've got fantastic talent and you know and today he's, he's, he's scored two great goals took them both really well as well and how important was it to get that second goal right at the end of the first half yeah I think it changed the complexity of the game completely because we all know what happened last week we've seen it last week you know the, the they've got like I said from set players they've got great quality they've got really really aggressive players good players that come and attack the ball and you've got to deal with it and at 1-0 anything can happen like it did last week you know, it was a dubious penalty, but a two 0 it just changes everything a little bit more. They've got to be a bit more open. They've got to be a bit more than just putting the ball in the box as much as they did. Free kicks, etc. Corners, diagonal balls in there. But yeah, it, it just gave us a little bit of breathing space to to maybe just wait and be patient and hit them on the counter attack when the game was very open. And in between the two goals, for as much as we talk about those, of course, Conor Roberts did pull off a, a yeah. great save when it was just that one goal advantage to the New Saints. Yeah, he did. He did. He's made, you know, it, it, it's standard with TNS goalkeepers. You know, Paul Harrison done it for years. Conor's doing it now. You know, you might not have an awful lot in the game, but you might have to make one save at a crucial time, which could be a turning point either way. And Conor's done it as well. Like I said, Paul done it for years, and it's it's really important. You know, the the concentration and the job that the goal. I do is because nine times out of ten we'll have majority share of possession and play and etc but, but yeah Connor's made a good save at a very important time and of course it's easy now to, to wrap up today's result and focus on next week's game against yeah. Ballatown in the league yeah definitely it's the most important game of the season because the next one we're going to enjoy today because we should do you know, I think you shouldn't get sick of getting in cup finals. You shouldn't get sick of celebrating getting in cup finals, and you you shouldn't get sick of looking for the cup finals. So we'll have a you know a good journey home. I'm sure, the bus will be lively, etc., etc. And then um, then we'll come Monday morning, and we're back to preparing for the most important part of the game.